Governor Ron DeSantis stomping in South Florida tonight with just four days to go until Election Day. Charlie Crist also hitting the road for the final push. Local 10's Janine Stanwood is in Coconut Creek with the latest on the fight for governor. Both camps trying to fire up their supporters and get out the vote. Governor Ron DeSantis here at this mixed martial arts training facility. You can see the big truck is now here and he'll be on to the next. <laughs> Governor Ron DeSantis in the fighting cage, literally holding a campaign rally at American Top Team, a mixed martial arts training facility in Coconut Creek. There was even an appearance by controversial MMA fighter George Masvidal. We want to send a very strong message that freedom is here to stay in the state of Florida. The governor repeating his message that Florida is pro-police. We are a law and order state in Florida. A better steward of tax money, an anti-mandate during the pandemic. So they were trying to prosecute a gym owner because he didn't make everyone wear a mask when you're working out. First of all, you're not supposed to wear a mask when you're working out. My name is Charlie Crist. Democratic opponent Charlie Crist also making campaign stops in Jacksonville Friday night, coming off a big visit in South Florida earlier in the week with President Joe Biden. Freedom is on the ballot in this election. Uh, your right to vote is on the ballot in this election. Governor DeSantis is making it harder to vote. I want to make it easier to vote. Um, I want to make sure that we make Election Day a state holiday. A lot of working folks have a hard time getting out to vote. Broward remains a stronghold for Democrats who outpace Republicans in early voting. But in Miami-Dade, for the first time in years, numbers show Republicans now have the edge. That fact no doubt has Republicans here fired up. By the way, early voting goes through Sunday. We're in Coconut Creek. I'm Janine Stanwood, Local 10 News. And we have everything you need to be election ready. Just scan the QR code on your screen to check out our voter guide on local10.com.